a fitting backdrop for a match of massive significance. The stage is set, a packed house at the ready, awaiting two teams who like nothing better than to test themselves on a stage like this. The tricky part is trying to decide which side will outbox the other. Don't go anywhere, the match is live right here on EA TV. Hello and welcome. This is the scene here at Molyneux. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, I like the look of their front three today. It has a combination of pace, skill and intelligence. But will they get enough of the ball? Because their midfield could be overrun here. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Harry Maguire plays with Victor Lindelof in central defence. Scott McTominay starts alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Well, it's a textbook example of dynamic passing. Encouraging stuff from United. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Lemina. Craig Dawson. Lemina. Keys handed into reception. Please can you go to reception if you've lost the regain keys. possession? Teamwork and passing in evidence. Well, good run and good ball control. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Scott McTominay. Here's Luke Shaw. It's with McTominay. Well, they win the throw following that challenge. Perfect challenge. Just wasn't going to part with the ball. Sofian Amrabat. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Can they forge ahead? Tremendously strong in the tackle. Lemina. And here's Cunha. Sofian Amrabat. Diogo Dallo. And it's with Amrabat. Scott McTominay. Lindelof now. Sofian Amrabat. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Mateus Cunha. Oh, in with a chance! He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. Sofian Amrabat. And there it is, the referee's whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Molyneux.
Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In... Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Superbly read and executed. Sofian Amrabat. Anthony. Harry Maguire now. Maguire. Diogo Dallo. Anthony, good work from Wolves to win back possession. Pedro Neto. 30 minutes left for play. Lemina. Nuri. Ryan Ait Nuri. Well, those stats tell you everything. A tight and cagey game without enough goal mouth action. Both teams need to get more players forward if they're to pose a real threat. They're showing a real will to win the ball. More than decent this from United. McTominay, can he put it away? Oh my word, there's excellent timing for you. What a challenge. Nelson Semedo. Into the final 20 minutes. And Wolves losing possession. Marcus Rashford. McTominay. At times they make passing look easy. Must take the lead here. And a precise challenge just when it was required. Ryan Ait Nuri. Here's a change for Manchester United. Number 39, Scott McTominay, coming onto the pitch, number 14, Christian Eriksen. Craig Jawson, Belgarde, Nelson Semedo, level pegging, but can they change that? Well, disappointing end to the move. Marcus Rashford. United might be able to cash in. Sofian Amrabat. Christian Eriksen now. Really could be. Must finish. That is tackling of the highest order. Oh, given away. Ericsson! Huge block. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one. Can he put them in front? He does! And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama.
Well, I'm sure the replay will confirm he got a touch on this, which he does. So he'd be really upset that he didn't keep it out. And that is that for this game anyway, and Wolves not taking anything at all from the match. How did you see it? Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance. And in the final analysis, Christian Eriksen will receive plaudits aplenty. Well, he's the match winner, and deservedly so. He was outstanding today. He's great to watch when he's in this sort of form.